going to uh, have two parts of the sample prep talk. The first part, I'm going to talk about protein extraction, okay, and the cleanup. And that's the sample prep part. So, sample prep is basically uh, all the steps from your cells or tissue all the way to ready for first uh, dimensional IEF focusing. And this includes uh, mainly four areas, four aspects. First, how do you disrupt the cells to get the real proteins and make sure you solubilize most of the proteins, you know. And then how to clean up the, you don't want to some thing in there to interfere with your IEF. And finally, the simple fractionation. This is going to be a, the second part of the sample prep talk. So, disrupt. I'm sure every lab has already established this method, but still, just to, just to for in general way, I want to cover this. Dis disrupt cells or tissues uh, in general you have a very gentle way or very harsh way. Okay. Um, if you have dealing with the uh, uh, samples that the cells you can you can do you can use the very gentle ways. Number one is osmotic lysis. You have low salt, high salt, break the cells and release the uh, uh, mostly cytosolic proteins from from your cells. You can freeze on the cell, also physical damage the cell membrane, okay, to release proteins. Very gentle detergent lysis, um, like um, Triton. Uh, X100. So this 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 is basically you know most of this just to get very hydrophilic proteins from your tissue or cells. Enzymatic analysis and I don't not many people use this approach, but it's still um, um, one of things you can consider if 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 it's suited of your study. I I went through this very quickly because I know. For your for your own research, you already established this. What I would like to say is, if you if your approach already gets you the target you know interest of protein of your interest, go ahead keep that way because we have a tool in the end to help you to clean up the stuff, uh, the protein samples for IEF study. Harsh ways. What are harsh ways to break the cells? Sonication. That's a that's a you know well known approach. I always use sonication to to get the cells. French press cells. I know a lot of uh, 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 laboratory use this, and you can hear really loud sound from from that lab. Bang. Uh, uh, yes, and this is quite efficient, quite efficient for <coughs> for some for some especially for really you know um, organelles with hard cell um, walls. This is this is quite um, useful. Grinding uh, and glass homogenizer. This is my uh, favorite. I combine this glass homo homogenizer basically a dancer. Okay, if you're doing tissue. After that, I will go to sonication. This is you can combine this those methods as well. I do this too. Okay, and grinding uh, usually um, you use um, liquid nitrogen. And then grind it into powder, and then add um, your lysis buffer to 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 do that. Glass beads homogenization. It's um, you know it's it's relatively new thing, but um, it's also quite um, um, useful in this case. 